600 miles off the coast of Ecuador, straddling the equator, lies an archipelago that has remained unchanged for millions of years, a place where animals live without fear, a place where nature is king, a place called the Galapagos. Anchored off the coast of Isla Bartolome, we begin our day with a climb of 372 steps. Our reward? One of the most beautiful views in all of the Galapagos Islands. A visit to the Charles Darwin Center gives us the opportunity to see firsthand the very successful efforts to restore the population of giant tortoises. A female frigate bird searching the skies is waiting for a female frigate bird to spot them. When she does, she will make her way down where they will begin their courtship and eventually start a family. Today I'm taking the uh, sheep underwater camera to do some footage around this particular place. Bartolome has a beautiful photography and uh, offers a, such a great variety of tropical fish. So let's see what I can find in this water so tonight we can do a fish ID. As spectacular as the marine life is underwater, it's just as magical from above. Back on shore, we come across a Sally Lightfoot crab, some marine iguanas basking in the afternoon sun, and without question, one of the most famous residents of the Galapagos Islands is a blue-footed booby. get to see the flightless cormorants, which are this very amazing bird in terms of evolution. Uh, evolutionary biologists, they said that it takes a lot more than that for a bird to change so dramatically. I want you to understand that our impact in here on the island is just minimal. We are uh, not having any consequences whatsoever to the behavior of these animals. They are ignoring us completely, which is the amazing thing about Galapagos. 